In the ever-evolving landscape of military technology, the pursuit of faster and more lethal weaponry has become a global race. One of the most significant challenges in recent years has been China's development of hypersonic missiles, which have the potential to change the dynamics of warfare. In response to this emerging threat, the United States has been investing heavily in developing laser weapons to counter China's hypersonic missiles. This video delves into the significance of hypersonic missiles, the development of laser weapons, and the possibilities they offer in countering this threat. Understanding Hypersonic Missiles Hypersonic missiles represent a paradigm shift in military technology. Unlike traditional missiles, hypersonic missiles travel at speeds exceeding Mach 5, or approximately 3,836 miles per hour. The incredible speed and maneuverability of these missiles make them extremely difficult to track, target, and intercept using conventional missile defense systems. They pose a significant challenge to the existing missile defense infrastructure, leading to a pressing need for new, innovative countermeasures. The threat from China's hypersonic missiles. China's advances in hypersonic missile technology have raised concerns to the United States and among its allies. These missiles can be equipped with both conventional and nuclear warheads, and they can evade existing missile defense systems, putting critical assets and populations at risk. China's investment in hypersonic technology has accelerated in recent years, and it is evident that these missiles pose a substantial challenge to the US and its allies. China's hypersonic missiles have the potential to disrupt the balance of power and escalate tensions in the Indo-Pacific region. Development of Laser Weapons in response to the threat posed by hypersonic missiles, the United States has been investing in the development of advanced laser weapons. These weapons use directed energy to incapacitate or destroy their targets. Laser weapons are highly versatile and offer several advantages over conventional missile defense systems. Speed of light. Laser weapons travel at the speed of light, enabling almost instantaneous engagement of targets. This speed advantage is crucial when dealing with hypersonic threats that can cover large distances in seconds. Cost efficiency. Compared to traditional missile interceptors, laser weapons are more cost effective in the long run. They don't require expensive rockets or ammunition, and their energy source is relatively cheap. Precision. Laser weapons offer exceptional precision, making them highly effective in minimizing collateral damage. They can precisely target and disable specific components of an incoming missile. Limitless ammunition. Unlike conventional missile defense systems, laser weapons do not run out of ammunition. They can continuously engage threats as long as their power source is available. Reduce logistics. Laser weapons reduce the logistical burden associated with maintaining and deploying traditional missile defense systems. They are compact and require minimal logistical support. If you are enjoying this video, then don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up if you're as excited as we are about this showdown. Your support keeps our content flying high. Challenges in laser weapon development. While the potential of laser weapons encountering hypersonic missiles is significant, their development is not without challenges. Some of the key hurdles include power generation. Laser weapons require a substantial power source to generate and sustain the high energy laser beam needed to disable or destroy targets. Developing compact and efficient power sources remains a challenge. Atmospheric interference. Laser beams can be affected by atmospheric conditions such as clouds, rain, and humidity. Researchers need to develop adaptive optics and beam control systems to counter these effects. Target tracking. Precise tracking of hypersonic targets in real time is crucial for laser weapons to be effective. Developing tracking and guidance systems that can keep up with these fast-moving threats is a complex task. Heat management. The intense heat generated by the laser weapon can damage its own components. Effective heat management systems are essential to ensure the weapon's reliability and longevity. International regulations. The use of laser weapons in warfare raises ethical and legal questions. There are international agreements and regulations that govern the use of certain laser technologies in conflict, and their application to laser weapons is a subject of debate. Before moving on, we have a question for you. What are the main challenges in developing laser weapons for countering hypersonic missiles such as power generation, atmospheric interference, and international regulations? Let us know in the comments section. Promising developments in laser weapon technology. Despite these challenges, significant progress has been made in the development of laser weapons. Some promising developments include solid state lasers. Advances in solid state laser technology have resulted in more compact and efficient laser systems. 
These lasers are easier to integrate into various platforms, including ships, aircraft, and ground-based installations. Fiber lasers. Fiber lasers are increasingly being used in military applications due to their high power efficiency and beam quality. They offer advantages in terms of reliability and ease of maintenance. Adaptive optics. The development of adaptive optics technology has improved the ability to maintain a focused laser beam, even in adverse atmospheric conditions. Power sources. Research into more efficient and compact power sources, such as high energy density batteries and capacitors, has shown promise in providing the required energy for laser weapons. Testing and deployment. The US military has been actively testing laser weapons in real world scenarios. The successful tests have demonstrated the feasibility of laser weapons encountering various threats, including drones and missiles. Laser weapons versus hypersonic missiles. The race continues. The race between laser weapons and hypersonic missiles is an ongoing and dynamic one. Both technologies continue to evolve, and each side is striving to outpace the other. The US military and defense contractors are committed to developing more powerful and capable laser weapons, while China is continuously advancing its hypersonic missile technology. US Laser Weapon Programs The US Department of Defense has invested heavily in various laser weapon programs aimed at countering the hypersonic missile threat. Some of the notable programs include High Energy Laser and Integrated Optical Dazzler with Surveillance. The Helios program is a Navy initiative that equips ships with high energy laser systems to defend against a variety of threats, including drones and missiles. It is designed to provide a versatile and scalable solution for multiple missions. Advanced Test High Energy Asset Developed by Lockheed Martin, the Athema system is a prototype laser weapon that has demonstrated its effectiveness in shooting down multiple drones. It represents a significant step in the development of laser technology for military use. Airborne Laser Testbed This was a U.S. Air Force program that tested the feasibility of using a megawatt-class chemical oxygen iodine laser in an airborne platform. While the program was discontinued, it contributed to the understanding of the challenges and potential of airborne laser systems. Self-Protect High Energy Laser Demonstrator The SHIELD program aims to develop a laser weapon system to protect aircraft from incoming missiles. It is designed to be compact and efficient, making it suitable for deployment on various platforms. Space-based laser systems. The US has also explored the possibility of space-based laser systems for missile defense. These systems would have the advantage of a clear line of sight to threats and could provide rapid response capabilities. The role of space-based laser systems. Space-based laser systems have gained attention as a potential solution for countering hypersonic missiles. These systems would involve placing high-energy lasers on satellites or other orbiting platforms. Some advantages of space-based laser systems include Global coverage Satellites in orbit can provide global coverage, allowing them to engage threats in any part of the world. Reduced atmospheric interference Space-based lasers would not be affected by atmospheric conditions, ensuring the accuracy and effectiveness of the laser beams. Quick response time these systems could provide rapid response times, reducing the window of opportunity for hypersonic missiles to reach their targets. While space-based laser systems hold promise, they also present challenges including the need for sophisticated tracking and targeting capabilities, power generation, and international legal considerations. China's Hypersonic Missile Advancements China has made significant strides in the development and deployment of hypersonic missiles. These advancements pose a formidable challenge to U.S. and allied defense efforts. Some notable developments in China's hypersonic missile program include DF-17. China's DF-17 is one of the most publicized hypersonic missile systems. It is designed to carry both conventional and nuclear warheads and is known for its maneuverability and unpredictability. Starry Sky 2 China's Starry Sky 2, an experimental hypersonic vehicle, is part of its pursuit of hypersonic technology. It has been described as a potential glide vehicle for delivering nuclear warheads. The U-14 The U-14 was one of China's earlier hypersonic missile tests, and it drew attention for its high speed and ability to change course mid-flight. Glide Vehicles China has been actively researching and developing hypersonic glide vehicles, which can be mounted on ballistic missiles to enhance their maneuverability and speed. The Impact of Hypersonic Missiles on Regional Stability China's advances in hypersonic missile technology have raised concerns among neighboring countries and the United States. These missiles can potentially undermine the stability of the Indo-Pacific region and have a significant impact on global security. 
The ability of hypersonic missiles to bypass existing missile defense systems has created uncertainty and a sense of urgency among U.S. military planners and policymakers. The U.S.-China hypersonic arms race. The competition between the United States and China in the field of hypersonic technology and laser weapons can be characterized as an arms race. Each side is working to outpace the other, leading to significant advancements in both hypersonic missiles and laser weapons. This arms race has far-reaching implications for global security and strategic stability. The United States, given its robust research and development capabilities, is actively engaged in countering China's hypersonic missile threat. The development of advanced laser weapons, both land-based and space-based, is a key component of this effort. These laser weapons are designed to provide a credible defense against the evolving threat posed by hypersonic missiles. China, on the other hand, continues to invest heavily in hypersonic missile technology and has made significant strides in their development and deployment. This has led to concerns about the impact of China's hypersonic capabilities on regional and global security, the future of laser weapons and hypersonic missiles, the ongoing arms race between the United States and China in the domains of laser weapons and hypersonic missiles is a reflection of the broader competition for military supremacy. The future of laser weapons and hypersonic missiles is likely to be characterized by the following developments. Evolving laser weapons. Laser weapons will continue to evolve in terms of power generation, beam control, and reliability. The U.S. military and defense contractors will work to make these weapons more compact and adaptable to various platforms. Expanded testing. The testing of laser weapons in real-world scenarios will expand, providing valuable data on their effectiveness and limitations. This data will inform further development and deployment strategies. Integration with missile defense. Laser weapons will be increasingly integrated into the broader missile defense architecture. They will work in concert with existing systems such as interceptors and radar to create a multi-layered defense against hypersonic threats. Global deployment, the United States may seek to deploy laser weapons in strategic locations worldwide to provide a more comprehensive defense against hypersonic missiles and other emerging threats. International cooperation, the development and deployment of laser weapons and the proliferation of hypersonic missiles will necessitate international cooperation and the establishment of rules and norms governing their use. China's advancements, China will likely continue to make advances in hypersonic missile technology enhancing its position in the arms race. This could lead to shifts in regional and global power dynamics. Conclusion The development of laser weapons to counter China's hypersonic missiles represents a critical advancement in the field of military technology. The ability to respond to hypersonic threats in real time, with precision and cost-effectiveness, offers a promising solution to a pressing challenge. The ongoing arms race between the United States and China in this domain underscores the significance of these technologies and their potential to reshape global security dynamics. While significant progress has been made in the development of laser weapons, challenges remain, particularly in power generation, target tracking, and international regulation. Moreover, China's continued advancements in hypersonic missile technology mean that the arms race is far from over. As the race between laser weapons and hypersonic missiles unfolds, it is essential for policymakers, military planners, and the international community to carefully monitor these developments. The decisions made in the coming years will have a profound impact on the future of warfare and the strategic balance among nations. The imperative is to strike a balance between ensuring security and stability and preventing an escalation of tensions in the Indo-Pacific region and beyond. So that's it for today. If you like this video, then please hit the like and subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching.